Hey guys, my name is Elona and I'm so excited as usual to see you on my YouTube channel. And in this very quick tutorial I will show you how to create this nice um, neon cube in After Effects without any plugins. And before we start, don't forget to hit a like, drop a comment and of course subscribe on my channel. The project file and more useful content for motion designers and illustrators will be available on my Patreon. You can find the link in the description. And yeah, choose the tier that works for you and join. Okay, let's create a cube very quickly. So I have a shape and then I duplicate it. Ctrl plus D, yep. And change anchor point. I use just anchor point tool. So super easy and press Ctrl to uh, snap my anchor point to the border of the shape. Let's do it very quickly. Okay, then I make all these layers uh, as uh, 3D layers. And now I have to rotate them. Okay, and now I have to duplicate the front shape and move it above and move it uh, behind the cube. And if we take a look from the left view, you will see that we create a cap for the hole. Yep. Okay, perfect. Let's move this cube to the precompose. Make it as a 3D layer again and don't forget to press collapse. In this case, you will get a nice cube here. I would like to change uh, the anchor point uh, to place it um, in the center of the cube. So let's do it. I need a guideline. Then I need top view. And move it somewhere here and then again using anchor point tool I place my anchor points exactly in the center of the cube. I use these numbers just because uh, I already know the you know size of my shape so it's 500 pixels so that's why I move it actually uh, using using just numbers so it's easy easier than you know do it uh, with your intuition or <laughs> using your eye <laughs> okay great let's make it a bit smaller and add wiggle to the orientation Okay, nice. And now the most interesting part, how I created this nice neon effect. Actually, I want to change the background um, color. Let's make it black. I use just uh, different uh, lights and I need just points and uh, all these lights, actually I'm gonna create three layers, um, uh, all these lights uh, will have different colors. So this one will be, for example, yellow. Okay, duplicate it and place it somewhere here, for example. And this one will be blue. Why not? And also I would like to increase intensity. Yep, let's make it higher. And for this one as well. Okay. And I would change the color. Make it a bit lighter. Yeah, and now you can see that we have very nice uh, blend colors and they look very interesting. So you can add even more, even more source of light.
change it, place it somewhere. And see, experiment with uh, your light, uh, position of these lights actually. And you will get very nice results also in my original project. Um, in my original project, I added uh, just glow to the whole um, to the whole cube and uh, to highlight some borders I also applied layer styles such as bevel and emboss you can see it you can see it here so they are also colorful and it creates nice borders you can take a look here so yeah, nothing very complex uh, and uh, to avoid any perspective distortions, I also created the cam camera uh, and uh, it's a kind of isometric camera, so it's not very complex again, but it creates nice um, straight you know, lines without any, any distortions. All this uh, stuff you can find on my Patreon, as I said before. You can also get the setup uh, of the isometric camera. So if you create some, you know, layers here, uh, you will see that you have this isometric perspective without any distortions. So all this stuff, uh, the project file is available on my Patreon. So yeah join select the tier that you like um, and yeah grab all this valuable stuff um, again if you like this tutorial let me know in comments mm, it will be super interesting to read uh, how you want to apply uh, this uh, very quick tip in your projects um, and uh, here you can see the list of patrons people who already supported me guys you're incredible i'm never tired you know to repeat it uh, thank you so much uh, and yeah, that's all. Thanks for watching my tutorial and see you very, very soon. Bye, guys.